Now, for more than a year, the Mobile County Public School System has been drawing up a rezoning map to balance the enrollment numbers in schools. And, Bob, those maps are supposed to be released to the public today, but that's once again been postponed. Fox 10 News reporter Candace Murphy shows you a larger version of those maps and what it means for you and your child's future. The Mobile County School Board is changing the attendance zones for dozens of Mobile County schools. Some of the changes are a result of Chickasaw and Satsuma splitting from the county system. This is Sarah Land City Schools, this will be Satsuma City Schools, and this will be Chickasaw City Schools. And then everything outside of those corporate boundaries have to be, have to be rezoned to new school systems. Mobile County School Superintendent Roy Nichols says he wants to have the rezoning finalized by January. It's going to happen quite abruptly. That's what we're going to try to tell them now, but in the fall it's going to happen. Everybody's going to change on the same day. Every color on these maps represents a different school. That just goes to show you how many schools are going to be affected by this rezoning process. It's, it's going to be uh, quite a traumatic experience, I think, for a lot of people because they were not planning on changing schools and uh, uh, because of the formation of new city systems, they will have to. Nichols says if parents want a child to stay at his or her original school, the child will have to go through a transfer process. The transfer is based on uh, are there any seats available. And if there are seats available, then we'll let them, but they'll have to provide their own transportation. It will be up to school board members to decide whether or not to accept or modify the rezoning maps. Reporting in Mobile, Candace Murphy, Fox 10 News. And the board has scheduled a public hearing at 4.30 on November 30th at the Central Office Complex at Howells Ferry and Schillinger Roads. Officials say those maps will be available soon online.